What's up squad? What's up gang? Do you guys notice anything different in my desk setup? I'll wait. I'll wait. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about this bad boy right here. I'm not talking about the microphone. I'm talking about the Throne Max Boom Arm. That's right. The Throne Max Boom Arm is new to my setup. And in today's video, I will be explaining to you guys why I got a boom arm. And I also will do a short unboxing in this video. So if you are interested in anything I just said, make sure you stick around. <music> So the main reason why I wanted a boom arm for my desk setup is to have easy access to my baby, the HyperX Quadcast, which is my microphone, by the way. And the Throne Max boom arm and the HyperX Quadcast will have a link in the description so you guys can have easy access, by the way. But back to why I wanted a boom arm. Like I said, I wanted easy access to my microphone and just about all the ways I record my content. That's content right here where I do like a headshot. That's content when I turn around the other way to give you guys tutorial Tuesdays. The only situation this doesn't work in is my unboxing videos because I do those at a different desk and this boom arm doesn't reach that far. So I have to figure out something that will solve that problem. I might get another boom arm for that desk and see what happens. But back to this setup. So I used to record with this bad boy. This is a mic stand and it used to be on the floor. It, it's a good mic stand. I probably will still use it, but it wasn't convenient for my Tutorial Tuesday um, videos because it didn't go into the setup like I wanted it to go into the setup. It was tacky, if you will. So what I did was unscrew it from that mic stand and put it onto this mic stand. This mic stand came with the HyperX Quadcast. Um, it's made from metal. It's a real good, sturdy um, mic stand. You can hurt somebody with this, you know, but yeah, it's real nice, sturdy mic um, arm. But the only problem with this mic stand is that it's too low and I had to position the microphone at an angle and I used to have to put my chair at the lowest setting and come up like this just to get some good sound out of the microphone. And sitting like that during a Tutorial Tuesday was uncomfortable. I was rushing through Tutorial Tuesdays. I don't know if you guys noticed or not, but now all of that is over. I'm sitting up in my chair comfortably, and that's the main reason I got this chair in the first place, is to have me to sit upright and have good posture while I'm working. And this didn't provide that, but this does. So that's another reason why I wanted a boom arm. So now you guys know why I got the boom arm. Let's get into the unboxing of this Throne Max boom arm. So once you crack this bad boy open, you are greeted with nothing other than the Throne Max boom arm wrapped in plastic with three styrofoam pieces on each anchor of the boom arm. Um, that's a nice touch. Make sure the boom arm is nice and secure. And one of the 
styrofoam pieces you have extra pieces if you want to mount this boom arm permanent permanently i said it right yeah permanent permanently to your desk permanently there to your desk but i ain't trying to go that route because i don't want to drill a hole in my desk and my setup might change and if you do that then you're just gonna have to patch that hole up and drill a hole somewhere else and i ain't about that life yeah it comes with that you also get the base the base that the boom arm comes with and you also get the manual yeah the manual doesn't really say much in it though it's just pictures but put in one of these um together you don't have to be a rocket scientist to figure this out this is a very simple process so let me get into the um process of putting this together all you do is take the base and mount it to wherever you want to put it on your desk now let me talk about the mountain um for this boom arm this clip the mountain plate that comes with the boom arm the clip does fit in the back of my desk i don't know if you guys remember i tried to mount my monitor to the back of my desk but the clip was too long so it didn't work it was hitting my um cable manage box so that was a no-go i had to do it to the side of my desk but the reason why i didn't put it all the way to the back of my desk is because if i did that i wouldn't be able to get this shot um tutorial tuesdays would have been good but this shot nah wouldn't be good so that's why it's right here and i wanted to put it on the side of my desk but the way my desk is made the sides are thicker than the front and back of my desk so i had to put it on the front and it worked out real well so back to um putting this boom arm together i got sidetracked i had to let you guys know about that so you just screw the clip onto where you want it on your desk. And then after you do that, you put the boom arm into the anchor like so. It's a real easy process. And then you're done with the boom arm. And then you have to mount your um, microphone to the boom arm as well. And I ain't gonna lie, it took me a while to get the boom arm to a real nice uh, position where I liked it and it flowed with my setup. When I did it at first, the mic was crooked. It was leaning like to the side and it was looking awful. So what I ended up doing is taking the shock mount off of my um, mic and I got the microphone to a position where i wanted it to be and i put the um shock mount back on the boom arm let me talk about this cable right here this is like probably the only cable you would see because this boom arm has clips that go on top and at the bottom of the boom arm for some real good cable management that's a nice touch i'm really digging that and the only con i would say with this boom arm is that on each anchor like these two like in the back they're good but this one right here the logo doesn't line up with the rest of the logos like it's on their cricket and, and that's just me picking at it that's the only con um i have ocd everything has to be <laughs> the right way so i could change it so you guys can see the knob but i want to show off the logo because it's gray and that is a color of my desk setup and I don't have enough gray things on my desk, so that will bring that out. And let me talk about 
the material that the boom arm is made out of is plastic and metal. So the boom arm itself is made from a real good quality plastic. The base is metal and I think the knobs as well, when you um, twist it, twist the tension, they are metal as well. This little piece is metal up here. So yeah, it's a really good dope product. I think I'ma love it. Um, only time will tell if this boom arm will be good or not. Yeah, so hopefully it will because I have a lot of faith in this Throne Max um, boom arm. Oh yeah, one more thing before I let you guys go. This boom arm didn't come with one, but it came with two stickers, which I thought was a really nice touch. And guess what? The stickers match my desk setup real, real well. So they are living on my filing cabinet now that lives on the left hand side right now but when i turn around it's the right hand side of my desk um one sticker is red and gray the other sticker is red gray and black like i said they match my colorway real well and oh yeah <laughs> you guys be like slow that's enough but it did come with two cable managed straps which i'm glad it did it didn't have to come with those but they came with it. I guess you can add them to the cable manage um, part of the boom arm. But I didn't do that because I didn't need to. But what I did was I took one and I put it under my um, desk. Because the cord runs under my desk. And it's holding the um, cable up in place. Because I have slots in my desk for cable manage. Um, situations so you can hide cables that way but i wanted the cable to be um secure because it used to like over time droop down the side so it's holding it in place real secure so i won't have to worry about that cable anymore so now that will do it for this video let me know you guys just thoughts and opinions in the comments what you guys think about this setup i think it took my um content to the next level and we are almost <laughs> to the way i want my set to look y'all yeah so let me know you guys' thoughts and opinions in the comments if you think this boom arm is dope or nope. And also, I want to give a shout out to all my new subscribers. I see my um, numbers going up on subscribers and I appreciate y'all. Welcome to the squad. Welcome to the gang. Yeah. And if you like my content and you like my personality, make sure you guys subscribe as well the unsubscribers that is so i catch you guys in the next video i'm gone i did enough talking on this one